Gold viewers from around the world. I'm Kristen Schwartz, licensed midwife and MC for Gold Learning, and I'm chatting today with Dr. Catherine Gregory about her upcoming presentation titled Building a Better Baby Biome. Welcome, Catherine. Thank you, Kristen. Thank you so much for taking the time and uh, chatting with me here today. And I want to chat a little bit, starting out with you. Um, tell us and our listeners a little bit about yourself and your professional journey and how you got interested in that topic. Sure. Um, well, my clinical background is as a newborn ICU nurse, and I really loved taking care of patients and families at the bedside, but was always really curious about preterm infant nutrition and gut health and was especially curious and concerned about a GI disease common to preterm infants, necrotizing enterocolitis. Um, this was enough to lead me through many years of graduate school and towards a PhD, really trying to better understand uh, what we call NEC or necrotizing enterocolitis in the NICU. Um, because that was a GI disease, uh, that in turn um, led me to the microbiome, and now that is really the focus of the research that I do here in Boston. Well, thank you. Thank you for um, letting us know a little bit about yourself. Um, that topic, um, building a better BB biome, it's fascinating, and we're learning so much about uh, the microbiome um, of newborns. It's a, a very um, hot topic right now, I would say, and, and many healthcare providers get a lot of questions from um, their clients and they're eager to learn. But um, I, I'm sure it's not always easy, so, so doing the research and um, working in this field. So uh, can you tell us a little bit about any challenges you have encountered or any barriers? Sure. Well, I, I do agree. I think the microbiome is fascinating. I've been studying the microbiome of preterm babies for about seven or eight years um, now, and I will say one of, there's many challenges, but one of them is I still think we have more questions than answers. So a lot of the amazing work that has been done, I would say, is very early days. Um, we've, I think, gotten to a place where we've done a good job describing the microbiome during infancy and how that may be influenced. But a big challenge is really what does that mean for the baby, the child over their lifespan? And we still have a great deal to learn in that regard. I'll say the other thing um, that has been challenging but also exciting is that the tools and technologies that we use in this area of science, um, which I'll not talk a lot about in this lecture but is going on in the background, are rapidly evolving. Um, and that's always tricky to stay ahead and to make sure you're using the tools and the technology that's at the state of the science. Mm -hmm. You brought up a really good point there saying you, you still have more questions and answers and the yeah. next step is also what now? What are we doing? What, what are, what's the next step? What are you doing with that knowledge? You know, where do we go from here? Correct. So it's going to be yeah. fascinating in the future yep. what comes our way. <laughs> Agreed. Um. Agreed. Without giving too much away, uh, what would you say is uh, what you would like our delegates to take away from your presentation? <laughs> sure, sure. Well, I think um, I think first and foremost um, is that really to appreciate that I think the microbiome does play a very important role in perinatal and neonatal health, and it's something that our hopefully the listeners of this lecture will leave um, saying that yeah, there is something important here. I think the other thing, though, is what I may point out in, in the studies that have been done um, is to really uh, to consume this science and this literature, but then to also be asking that next question and really taking a look at these studies um, with their clinical view and say, well, what about these patients or what about those patients and what does that mean for my practice? So to be, I think, appreciative of what's been learned, but then also a little suspect about where we and, and what that means and where we need to go. A little suspect where we need to go. I like I like that very much, and I'm very much looking forward to your presentation. Thank you so much, uh, Catherine, for chatting with me here. Um, building a better bi baby biome is part of the microbiome in the perinatal period lecture pack. And for more information on this presentation and, and the other presentations in this lecture pack, please visit www.goldperinatal.com. Thank you all for listening and thank you, Catherine. Bye-bye for now.